Yeah, Ike has always been one of those characters that if he's he's a snowball, if the, the more damage he does on you, the more it attacks on, and then it just leads into more into a sock eventually. It snowballs. Definitely one of those characters to watch out, especially in terms of range. Uh, very flowcharty, but when the flowchart matches the entire setup, man, are you losing? Yeah, but I also think the good Ikes are getting so good at mixing up that like he doesn't really. He's like maybe a flowchart character like at like low level, but to do well with him, you know, at like top level versus all like the top tier characters, gotta be really good. Yeah, you you start. Yeah, that's that's the one thing I like about watching top level Ikes, is like you said, they mix it up. Um, they're able to just go ahead and go for things like tomahawk grab, empty hops, or tomahawk slash empty hops, and then they usually are very good at mixing up with their landing aerials, their spacing. That's all. That's what separates, you know, the good Ikes from the great Ikes to the best Ikes, you know. Yeah. So I think this is a Zelda player. Just the Ice. Can't. Can't remember off the top of my head. But I'm not sure who played it. I wonder if he actually plays Diddy Kong. Because of the icon. I don't know. That'd be cool though. Diddy's another character you don't see that much. But Thank I God. think he's pretty solid. That character was oppressive in every way. I still think he's really good, honestly. Yeah, he's good. Uh, the reason people were like, oh no, he lost an infinite, and I was like, you think he needed an infinite to be good? <laughs> yeah, I didn't. The infinite is just like icing on cake. Yeah, it is definitely an icing on the cake. He's. Definitely solid character. Yeah, I just think like he's just uh, they're just better characters in the game, so he gets like overshadowed by the other ones. Doesn't like mean that he's bad or anything like that. Okay, are we gonna get the first game? <laughs> In time now. Oh God. Uh, there should be a button, sorry, Shane Train, there should be a button that tells you about uh, about a mod request, to request a mod. Uh, I, I literally cannot, like, sorry, I'm, I'm trying to get to you, but there you go. I see you. So I guess you won your opponent lost. I'm going to go ahead and fix that for you. Okay. I was right. What is it? Hmm. This can be kind of difficult, I think. For Diddy, approaching can be hard. I think once the, you know, night's out. Also has reflector, but good Diddy's don't. They beat out reflectors with banana most of the time. Either way, though, boy, off to a pretty good start playing around the setups and Zelda pretty well. Gotta be careful though, Zelda can kill the really early. On point. Like it just takes one mistake. Oh, like that, for smash. Yeah, I see, like the Nehru's love is like being used liberally here by just the ice. Just cause you know, every time the banana's out, you just wanna try to reflect it back, but yeah, see, you can. Oh, he's a little bit too early. But yeah, you can bait it out in front of you. Yeah. That setup still works. That's, that's the thing about smash. that's the thing about Zelda's near as well. Is it not only does it have intangibility, but it also does multi hits and a reflector. It's literally three things in one. Yeah, but oh, oh, I didn't get there. So much. Nice. I really like the falling up there. Don't see that a lot of, from uh, other duties. As a combo extender, but it's very good. 
Like Humble we used to see a little bit, like as an extender back in Smash 4. But yeah, and ultimately now that Diddy has been changed in terms of buffs, um, yeah, I think we're going to see that. Just a little bit more. Wow, that was good. That was good. Yeah, he covered a lot of options there. Yeah, just like forcing him to jump with the knight at the ledge and covering it really well. Oh, there's a monkey flip though. Once Diggs start conditioning you to hold shield, gotta watch that side B. Very good. Oh, no. Got the lock of the dare, but no, like, if you are punished, unfortunately. Nice banana setup, but again, too early. Oh, like, he really should, uh, hold the banana and just wait. Because most of, like, I wanna say nine times out of ten, they're gonna use the reflector there. Oh, oh, nice. Catch on the neutral layer there. Oh, barrel technician. Barrel shenanigans. Oh my god, that fucked it last so long. It's so weird. I can tell he waited that time too. Nice. Go to the other ledge there. With the up B. Oh, nice. The point moving right now, really clean. Oh, oh, he didn't get the right hit. Man, this guy's getting some really unlucky situations right now. Oh, that shield's really small. Oh, nice. Caught the landing there. Getting a little bit too uh, happy with those jumps for it. Okay, yep. Oh, wow. Interesting first story. Again. Oh, oh, they still have time to shield, but, oh, wow, nice, moves up on the shield, with the S knife up there, but again, you can see, Void is waiting out a lot of these options, huge punish, a lot of Zeldas will try to hit you with that, uh, Fjord's Wind, that up B, thinking that, you know, catch you off guard, but literally all you have to do is hold shield, it's like one of the easiest moves to punish. Super easy to punish. Also, really good stuff on just the ice because he went for Knight really below the stage. But a lot of people actually seem to forget Knight's hitbox can actually extend below the stage. It can actually catch you off guard. Very similar to like how Ivysaur can use a Vine Whip or Marth can use Dolphin Slash. Like you, you gotta be careful because <laughs> it'll, it'll definitely get you. Yeah. It's really, really, really uh, something that throws a lot of people off. But I don't know if Ice has a secondary. I, I don't know. I don't know if the matchup is that bad to where he needs to switch. I just think he needs to like change up some things in neutral. Like he's getting a little overzealous with the the neutral B. I mean, we saw some really bad upbeats on stage as well. Honestly, Floyd's uh, evasion of the like knight and all the projectiles of Zelda has been really good. Yeah, Zelda online Zelda can be uh, a very stressful pain to deal with. Yeah, I think Zelda is definitely one of the better characters online. But uh, Floyd just playing around like the strengths of online Zelda really well. Just being very evasive and mobile with Diddy, especially when he has a lead. Uh, I, I still think, like, how it makes Zelda can be like frustrating is when like you're forced to approach her and then you start running into all of her like setups. But if you have a lead and she's the one that's like you know holding forward, it's very uh, easy to like, punish her. Really deal with her. Right now though, it's really good for Ice. I like the choice of uh, holding the banana and then using the projectiles. You can like still have a whole bunch of things on the stage while like Diddy can't use the down B. Still punish there, catching up the side B. Diddy's <laughs> love to go for that, especially off the side of the stage. Nice. Good patience, honestly, he had no reason to over approach. Well, especially uh, when you see Knight. Okay, the neutral B of Zelda is different from other reflectors, I'm noticing. So, if you wait 
for the whole animation to end. Zelda still has enough time to shield, which is like not something that's common with the other fighters. Like, it's, it's the animation and not only that the frame data for it, it's it's and don't know off the top of my head honestly, but the fact that it's very, very fast, very safe, and has intangibility as well as a reflector ability as well, it's honestly it's one of the best reflectors in the game. Yeah, that's uh, interesting. That's kind of rough for Floyd then, because like he is waiting for that to like you know get a punish, but uh, it's really rough for him, and he's just getting blown up by setups right now. Yeah. Falling out of the S smash, hit by boy smash as well. I would love to see some more grabs from uh, Ice, just because he he has like Floyd scared and shit a lot. He can just yeah. get some free throws. He's Throw doing a really screen. good job of just doing enough pressure to. To put Floyd in such a bad foot that he has to hold shield enough for a grab. Yeah, this is a huge turnaround for Ice. Nice. B reverse. Neutral B there. Oh my god. That's so up. Gross. Forcing the shield with the knight and getting the free grab again. Okay. Yeah, like, that was good from Floyd because you can actually escape it with platforms, but also you can just use Diddy side B. Oh my god. This guy's going. <laughs> oh, that was insane. <laughs> Insane answer. He like that was, he went like so extra for that. Just to get the first stock. Okay, one ledge to the other. Oh wait, nice. Good banana to use coverage too, especially if Zelda tried to get away. Enough pressure there at the side. Oh. Wow, 55 to 40. Oh. Nice. The deepest Fourier oh. of all time was not worth. Like, I, I think he thought that Fourier would kill, so that's why he fast though. But yeah, Diddy B fair is not like. <laughs> oh, wait, what's going on? Okay. Yeah, Diddy, Diddy fair, I don't think the knockback was changed. I can't remember, but I do. I definitely can tell you the hitbox has a bigger. Has a bigger window for sure, so you have to be careful with spread just a little bit more. Yeah, see, he has to go for the monkey flip because he can just block the banana throw. Yeah. After the neutral beat. Oh, he is swinging. He is literally like, please get hit by a kill me, please. I'm begging you. I, I need this stuff. I'm fighting for my life. <laughs> <laughs> Ice is just holding on to this stock forever. Any little hit he gives is just so good for him. Oh my god, I almost died to the knight. I didn't, I see, I didn't like the situation because he could have just gotten away with side B, but he chose these days to try to land on the stage. When sometimes just getting away from that general area is much better than just trying to come back and get a combo or punish your opponent. Especially when you're Diddy and you have a really good side B. Oh, that's dead. No, no, he's good, he's good, he's good, he's good. No, 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 no. Yo. Oh. On that up B, huge intercession with the up air. Damn, that was a really good game for Ice. Definitely turned it up for sure. I think that was just a good counter pick. So big, had like so many platforms to retreat to. Like really good for uh for Ice there. This is a good start. I like this. I like seeing this matchup actually. Very different from what I'm used to. Yeah. We don't we don't see too many Zeldas in general unless it's Elite Smash or Quick Play. <laughs> so seeing a Zelda come out here and do pretty solid is definitely a change up. Yeah. And I play Diddy a little well not so much in, in every other game. So I, I like See what Floyd's going for a lot of times. Let's see what this counter pick looking like though. So good thing about winning the first game. But there's not like a lot of super like there's not a lot of stages in this uh, stage list really, so I would like Battlefield on for Floyd. But let's see. Yeah, I don't know. I think Ice might might bend that stage, honestly. Um, yeah, it's worth banning.
And he's really thinking about this counterfeit. You got that one one on point, like you kind of want to be a little more cautious, you know? Yeah, even though like I feel like he had really down uh, game two. But... Okay, where, where are we going? Oh, all right. Now Floyd needs to do something. Alright, game three. Oh, I don't... One, yeah, I don't like this. I'll be honest with you. <laughs> I, don't, I do not like this. This is over, but... Let's see. Let's see what Floyd can do here on his counter pick. Oh! I mean, he still got the follow up, but like, yeah, he needed. I feel like on another stage, he could have gotten near down, down there. Yeah. Okay. Nice shield pressure. Oh my goodness. So much to deal with. Again, using that neutral B. Floyd's like, he's so cautious of when to throw his banana. Interesting monkey flip. Kind of give up all the state control. Almost got killed for it, but it's fine. Oh, nope. Not able to get the down tilt into the smash attack. Almost dies full screen from the force smash. Oh my goodness, all the shield pressure there. And he trapped on the platform. Oh my god, the peanut came in clutch. Okay, not enough to kill, but he does have a banana and a red trap situation. That down here was not guaranteed because he didn't get the hit confirmed with the banana, but he still made it made it work. That was nice. Oh, bad trade though. Didn't expect that to trade actually. That's normally just like a combo at that percent. Going back and forth here. Nice. Pressuring him at the ledge, covering the jump too. Oh! Oh my god, he went for it again. That boy is going, he's going in on this stock. Oh yeah, he knows. He's got Zelda at 102. You need to get in before Zelda gets the opportunity. Okay, Chase. Oh, not ready for the get of attack. Okay, but catches the line with the smash. Ooh. Oh, that's so scary. They're both holding shield. Oh my. Wait, did he block that? Yeah, he, no, he, 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 he buried. He, from what I saw, oh, he buried. My. I thought he got hit. Yo, that was a sick carry. Great punish, too. Oh, okay. Nice punish. On the uh, neutral, we finally able to get a trip. Oh, yeah, Floyd is like, he's trying to go in, but oh my god, another lightning kick, dude. Every time Floyd thinks he can push his lead, he just gets kicked in the face. And now we're on game three, last stock. Went down to the wire. Oh my, I knew, I knew he was gonna go for that. <laughs> As soon as he forced me to go low, like, every Diddy main is going to go for this down here. <laughs> he wanted to end the game immediately. Nice, good cross up, good cross up. Especially with the banana in front, it kind of gives Zelda a little bit to worry about. Yeah, Floyd's applying the pressure too. Right. I didn't, I didn't like the forward toss, but still good enough to actually still put him in a nice position here. Oh, watch the ledge. Oh. Oh no, my god, no, no. that up is crazy and it goes through the neutral V. Floyd finding the Floyd smash closing out game three on